Welcome back everybody to Elder Scrolls Online. We are just, um, we've just spoken to this gentleman here and he's told us to head on out to the uh, the graveyard where we're going to summon the spirit of Cloudy and find out why the curse mustn't be broken and what deals she made um, in order to save her unborn child. Oh, my alchemy Fine. just went up. Yes. I was beginning to think you'd never show up here. Uh, hi, Venice. Bye, Venice. <laughs> oh, no. He's the one that's been yelling at us. Man, he's going to be so mad at me. I, I just have something else I've got to do first. I promise I'll come back. Okay? Maybe, if you're a very lucky, lucky man. Right. <laughs> we'll come back and talk to you. I know. That's so mean. Let's uh, head this way. I'm trying to be focused so you guys don't end up with me following half a dozen quests that you have no idea why I'm doing what I'm doing. Um, so we're going to try and finish the Curse of Balborn Tower. Um, that's right. We've got to head into the graveyard which is over here. But it takes us right past the bank. And how could I resist a chance to throw a few more things in here? Let's do that. She's always so busy, this lady. I don't know how she ever finds any time to talk to me with so Welcome many other people. Thank you so much. Uh, grab our materials, because it'll make it a bit quicker. The Danger Heart, Decorative Wax. Oh, that's right. I can't put that in there. Uh, do, do, do. I don't know if I've got a lot this time around. The Iron Ingots don't fit either. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Pewter Dust. All right, well, I got rid of one thing, <laughs> one thing, out of my backpack. Fine, I'll live with it. Uh, is this where we're meant to go? This is the graveyard? Yes, I'm looking for fish. It may seem inappropriate, but I'm putting off this moment. Cloudy. What is this place? What happened to the tower? <laughs> what have you done? The veil was hard, you didn't they? You don't understand. You don't know what I gave up to stop them. I lost everything. I lost my... my baby. Tell me what happened. I fell in love with a coward. A veil born who couldn't disappoint his mother. Even if it meant his beloved had to die. My love turned to hatred in that tower. Before the end, I begged and prayed for someone to help my unborn child. And someone answered your prayer. You have to understand. Akatosh Daedra. It didn't matter who heard me. I just wanted my baby to live. Then what happened? I made a bargain. Got my revenge. Saved my baby. The Baleborns deserve to lose what they love the most. Their wealth. Their lands. I felt my child leave me. I could smell the smoke from the tower. I heard the screams. The deal had been struck. The Baleborns are different now. The Baleborns don't change. That family carries evil in its heart. Let them all rot. The ward in the waterfall will always keep the Baleborns away. The master made it with his own blood. What? happens if I remove the ward? No! You can't! The master won't let you. My, my baby! What, what would become of him? The master would kill him. I don't believe you would do such a thing. You know the Baleborns are evil. You know that my curse must stand. I've got to talk to that guy who collects cursed things. I mean, he could have an entire cursed tower to put his collection in. He'd be thrilled. Okay, break the curse or tell Athel Baleborn to leave. Well, let's let's see what happens if we tell Athel to leave. Um, I mean, it's not fair on him either, but but what happens if we tell him to leave? I don't think I'm going to get his undying friendship either way. Um. Oh, definitely won't get it this way. Oh, fish. Alright, we need at least one fish, okay? 
Do I have the right bait? Oh, thank goodness. I actually have insects. Radio. Let's go. I'll just stand in the water here. Nothing's going to attack me in here, right? I mean, it's, there's no crocodiles today, so we're okay. Excellent. A salmon. So all we need this salmon for, we're just going to go E to use. And we're going to get some fish. So when we get back to a cooking fire, I'm going to turn that into fishy sticks. And I'm going to... Um, ooh, what's that? It's a glowy piece of paper. We must... What was... Alright, all I want to do is read the memorandum. Indrik Emergence of Formal Development. If found, please return to the Sepiak Undes College of Sepiaks or to any licensed courier. My reading on the Indrik observations has led only to more mysteries. Alright. Such curious... Majestic creatures. Let me just examine this sack. Nope, oh, nothing there. Okay, well I found... There's an event on? Really? Oh, he's, a, he's an assistant. Are you here about a reward? For one of our excellent festivals or celebrations? I'm just the assistant, unfortunately. And I don't have access to our stock. You'll have to come back when the impresario returns. Sorry. Uh, that's all right. I, I've, I've not come across him like this before, so I'm kind of... So clearly I have some tickets, and I have some coin, and I'm not allowed to buy anything. Okay, because I don't have the prerequisites. Oh, but I do, do have this. I could stick this in my parlor. <laughs> uh, hmm. All right, but then it would be in my backpack until I actually did. Now, can I sell him stuff? I can sell him stuff. He can have some poison. He doesn't look like the kind to use it, so I, I feel pretty safe letting him have that. We'll sell him the lager because he does look like he needs a good drink. <laughs> He's a bit worried about adventurers being mad at him, I guess. We, we can't blame him, really. All right, let's, uh, let's leave the poor guy alone if he'll let it me out of here. Um... So I could, I could go and remove the curse up there somewhere. Or we could tell Mr. Bailborn that his dad was as not nice as he keeps thinking he wasn't. And, um, and we could just, you know. Oh dear. Oh yep, yeah, there's the chirp that tells me they're going to blast me into oblivion. Not nice little bug boy. I'll have some mushrooms. You can have a bird to the head because you're flying and obviously need friends. And then your friend can have a friend. Ow, I need a mushroom. Mushroom! It's kind of like medic, but a bit different. Besides, the XP is good, right? And I don't have an XP boost with this character, so I'm going to have to earn it. Is that Bugloss? No, it's Flax. We'll have the Flax. I'm not sure if I need more healing. I'm just going to check it out. No, I don't need more healing. We're good. Ooh, I'll have that though. Looks good. High iron ore. So there's no more space in my bank for iron, but there is space in my bank for high iron. I should probably do a bunch of crafting. I keep saying it. Not getting to it yet. No, please don't. Hey. Oops, I'll have that too. What's going on? I was able to get this far, but I still feel the approaching dread and building terror. Did you talk with the spirit? Yes. Your grandmother and father were cruel and heartless, and they earned this curse. I told you my father was a bastard, but what he did happened many years ago. I had no part in that. Why should I have to suffer for what he did? You have a point. It doesn't matter. Listen, you need to convince the ghost to move on. But maybe the curse should stand. Please, convince the spirit that we suffered enough. My mother ordered the higher guards to reclaim this place no matter the cost. It's out of my hands. These men will kill anyone who gets in their way. Your guards didn't fri don't frighten me, and the curse must re remain in effect. Damn it, I tried to warn you. Remember that. I tried. I'm leaving before the ghost makes my head explode or something. I'd run if I were you. Yeah, sure. Now I've got to find him again. Hey, you, Mama's boy, come back here. Useless, the 
both of you. We'll handle this ourselves. Go I see. I see how it is. Backstabbing brute, come here. It looks like she would kill her son as well. Let me just um, mushroom myself for a minute. There we go, that feels so much better. Claudie, what did you do? Every Baleborn who dares to return to this land shall fall. What happened? The Baleborn heir. He could have been my son if Maurice had only stood up to his evil mother. Instead, he let her lock me in that tower. What happened? Only what was meant to be. But what happened to Ethel? He ran headfirst off this cliff. The curse remains in place just as Tacnine promised when he first appeared to me in the tower. You know, I never asked what happened to my child. It's comfort enough that Tacnine continues to honor our bargain. Why did the, didn't the curse affect me? You aren't a Baleborn. Besides, we believed that you would do the right thing. I hope my child grew up with the same virtues that you demonstrated here. Thank you. Uh, you're welcome. Oh. Wow. You put the spirits to rest at Baleborn. Uh. I don't think the game... Oh no, there we are. The game is going to let me get out of my stupid decision to run down the cliff. Uh, yeah. Right. Thanks, lady. Hey, there's a story quest over here. Uh, Weiris... Yeah, Weiris Iliana is this zone, I think. Alright, where am I going? And what am I doing? Yeah, we're going to talk to the Weiris. What's over here? We're not talking to the Rothgar ambassador. It's really confusing. We also have Veil vale of the Guardians over here. Maybe the Weiris is part of that. We also need to go find... Oh, we need to find Merrick and Aleph. Alright, well, let's see how far we get this episode. We are closer than the last episode, right? Hi. Please, we're dealing with serious matters here. I can see the that. The Guardians are in desperate need of our aid, and any interruption can have dire consequences. Uh, Weiris Helene sent me to you. Oh, my apologies. You must be the stranger who helped my sisters at Delin's Mill. Mm -hmm. I'm honored to meet you. Uh, thank you. I can't talk long. As you know, things are not well in our woods. Mm. The Guardians have gone silent, and this corruption spreads. Who are the Guardians? They're elemental spirits. They used to guide us, but now, nothing. And just when we need them the most, there's an old right to contact them that might work, but it's too dangerous for me or my sisters to perform. Perhaps I can perform the right. I don't know. You're not one of us. But we have to try something, I suppose. See the lurchers out there. Uh -huh. Gather their limbs. That's the dangerous part. Then burn the limbs at the altar atop the nearby ruins. If it works, a guardian should appear. All right. I'll perform your ritual. If you're able to speak to the elemental spirit, find me at the Vale of the Guardians. All right. It's north of this location. I'll wait for you there. And please hurry. We need the wisdom and guidance of the guardians now more than ever. Tell me more about the guardians. If you must know... The Guardians are the Elnafe. They've been a part of the land since the dawn of Tamriel. The Guardians have been with us since we first found the Weird Tree. They protect the land and guide us in our duties. And w what's a lurcher? They are abominations of the Bloodthorns. Okay. The lurchers were Spriggans once, until the cultists twisted and corrupted them. That's what the Bloodthorns do. We must stop them. Okay. All right, so we have two areas to unlock in this in this zone. So as I'm doing going through the zone story, I'm unlocking everything that I can on the map. So we've got uh, this one here, the Vale of Guardians, and the um, the Vale Watch Tower. And if you have a look over here, you'll find Vale of Guardians is probably somewhere on this map. No, I'm wrong. It's not there. Vale Watch Tower is on the map. We haven't unlocked it, but um, Rosalor did. Chill House, Palmolag, and Mezzanthanos Tower are the set stations we need to find to find out what we can make there. The Glenumbra public dungeons are... Are they public dungeons, not the group dungeons? Maybe we could survive it. We also need to find the Kingsguard Dolmen. Uh, join up with a group beating up the bosses. We have a ton of Sky Shards to, to find. That's about 
16 tank forest, 12. So we've got about four more skill points worth of things here. Ah, oh, Shalados Library books. We um we have a few to find here. Oh my giddy aunt. Radio. So let's um that's a lurcher, right? Let's bug the lurcher. Uh oh. And bird the lurcher. Alright, how many arms did I need? Five. Alright, well let's go find another one. There's one. Excuse me, can I borrow your arm? Um, do I have an empty soul gem? I wonder. Does this thing have a soul? Okay, I have an empty soul gem, but... But... Uh, alright. Maybe I can just get the lurches on the way out. Oh, hello! Oh no, I'm not ready! Uh, right. There's another one over here. Oh, well, I don't think she belongs here. I think she's part of the problem. Bug! Ha <laughs> Oops! Boom. Let's uh, let's bug this one. Uh, mushrooms. Okay, I'm starting to get the hang of how to how to stay healed and how to how to do the thing. I need one more lurcher arm. I'm pretty sure I saw one more lurcher over here. We'll just grab this pewter while we're in the vicinity. I might stop and um yeah, visit a few places. Let's get that tree out from in between us. Oops. Alrighty. That's five lurcher arms. Summon an elemental guardian. We got this. Maybe. Oh, hi guys! Man, throwing things at me is not very nice. <laughs> What's in the barrel? What's in the crate? Let's go. And the crate. And the crate. Ooh, a backpack. Mine. Maybe. <gasps> yes, an Argonian cup. Let's learn that recipe right now. Get that out of our pack. Beautiful. That looks good, but it's not what I'm after. Altar of the Elnafe. Oh, well, we're here. Uh huh. Oh. Greetings, child. Hi. We have been waiting for someone to summon us. Uh huh. Angoth, the Gravesinger, has imprisoned us, and we are cut off from the weird. You must set the Guardians free. Alright, how do I set you free? Have mortals so soon forgotten the old ways? I was never Surely taught them. Surely the Weirises remember the Standing Stones. First, the stones must be cleansed of Angoth's dark influence. Protect the weird while they destroy the corruption binding the stones. Will destroying the corruption set you free? No, but cleansing the stones should loosen Angoff's grip. Mm -hmm. Tell Weary Selina about the corruption. She will know what must be done. Our time grows short, mortal. Free us before Angoff's corruption takes hold. Oh, that's a worry. Tell me more about the Guardians. We are the echoes of old voices, remnants of a time long ago. Still, a few of us remain. We were the Ifre, then we became the Elnafe. The earth bones. We nurture the land and guide the weird. They call us guardians. What is the Bloodthorn called? They are a pestilence. They serve the corruption that binds us. The one called Angoff, the Grave Singer. The cult spreads his decay, planting his blighted seeds to pollute the natural world. They prepare a path for Angoff's true master, Molag Bal. Who, who is Angoff? 
He is a tremor in the land, a poison in the water. He is a whisper, a shadow, a chill wind. He is grave singer and reach mage, necromancer and corrupter. Death and decay are his domains. Angoth binds us and seeks to make us part of him. Uh, a reach mage? What is that? Far from here, where the earth and sky grow cold, lies the chill of the reach. Daedra worshippers live there, mocking the Aedra, the Elmafe. They call themselves Reachmen, and their mages pollute the land with dark magic. And, and a Gravesinger? What's that? Gravesingers are necromancers that seek power over life and death. They seek to control the realms we would nurture and protect. They call upon the Daedra, who hide in darkness, to aid them in their efforts. Okay, let's see what we can do about getting you out of there, hey? Talk to Weiris Iliana. Oops, can I make that, do you reckon? Oh yeah, we can just run down here. There we go, no need to commit um, suicide by jumping off a cliff. Uh, no doubt we're going to want to find those later. I'll have that, whatever that is. Can I talk to that horse? It looks lonely. Oh, who's Jomo the Sharp? I have a long walk about ahead of me, Wayfarer. Make your purchases quickly so I may be on my way. All right. He looks like a red guard. What does he carry? Repair kits. <gasps> a lead. If I buy this, I'm going to buy this, and then and then we're going to go up. We're going to take a break and go up and, and get into the scrying line of stuff. Let's buy that. Right, so I have about 30, and I'll buy that. All right, cool. So we're going we're gonna to have to go to, um, yes, I know where. I've forgotten its name. I heard a whisper echo through the forest. Was it the Guardians? Did they talk to you? Yeah, they're imprisoned. The Guardian said we need to cleanse the Sanding Stones. I'm imprisoned? Our enemy is that powerful. Uh-huh. We will do whatever we can to help. The Guardians must be set free. All right, then. What must we do? Without the aid of the Guardians, we can't regain control of our weird tree. The Guardian said the Standing Stones must be cleansed. Send your weird there. Four of my sisters have gone north to cleanse the stones, but they need protection. Corrupted creatures attack them before they can destroy the foul vines that choke the stones. You must go and help them. All right. Destroying the vines is only the first step. The Guardian said you'd know what else to do. Of course. The standing stones. I should have realized. Take my amulet and protect the weird. When they're done, weaken a lurcher and use the amulet to control it. Bring the controlled lurcher to the standing stones on the hill. We'll do the rest. All right, then. I'll, uh, I'll do that. Meet us at the ritual site and don't forget the lurcher. Ha. Huh. Radio. Well, let's go defend the Weiresses. Where's the nearest one? She looks closest, but if I if I work from left to right, I might not get too confused. Aha. Uh -huh. Who am I kidding? Radio. Let's go this way. How's my backpack looking? 77 out of 90. So we have 13 spaces. Anyone who tells you math can't be used for fun hasn't played games. Ah, uh, there you go. Weera Selina told me you would come. I hope this works. Please don't let anything happen to me while I destroy these vines. All right, I'll make sure you have the time you need to destroy the vines. You know, when you say it like that, I almost believe it. Oh, thanks. Let's do this thing. All righty. Stay alert. I'm not done yet. Okay. There's another one. Finally gone. I need a minute to catch my breath, and then I'll meet you at the ritual site. All right, as long as you're fine. Now there's um. We're just gonna grab this weird tree way shrine while we're here. Just so that we've got it on our map, that we, and we, then we can teleport to it if we need it. Uh, and then what we'll do is we'll divert back and we'll rescue the other the other weird sisters. But usually what I find is if I miss miss an opportunity to tag something like this, 
I'll forget where it is and then I'll spend hours looking for it later. So when it's that close it's worth just diverting a little bit to go get it. It hasn't cost us a lot of time. We're a shale. Radiates from this thing. I can feel it worming into my soul. The corruption spreads outward, altering or killing all the forest creatures. We have to destroy it. All right, I'm here to protect you. Are you ready? Then keep me safe while I destroy this damn thing. I'll do my best. I need more time. I'll give you more time. Where's your enemy? Oh, there they are. No. Missed him. It's destroyed. I'll meet you at the ritual site once I've rested for a minute. All right. Oh, I love the way the stones change. That's so pretty. They go from being these these vine and crusted things. Now, did I attract attention? No, not not the not the unshakable kind. I these vines. They reek of death and corruption. But every time I try to deal with them, I'm attacked by cultists or corrupted creatures. All right, I'll keep you safe. Destroy the vines. I wish I had your confidence. I mean, I know what to do. And now you're here, right? Oh, what am I so worried about? Consider those damn vines destroyed. All right. Let's find out where your enemy is. Wow, sorry lady, I let him get way too close. Faster. I need to go faster. Be ready for another attack. Uh, I'll try. There it is. Wow, thank you. It. Give me a minute and I'll meet you at the ritual site. Sure, no worries. Corruption huh? runs through them and they choke the sacred stone. Soon they will tap into the stone's magic and defile it completely. If you will help me, I can destroy these foul vines. I'll keep you safe. Just destroy those vines. Your confidence is inspiring. Thanks for that. Now prepare yourself. The vines protectors will be on us as soon as I cast my spell. Uh, yep. You're absolutely right. Where are they coming from this time? I did buy myself another stone. Yes. Keep them off me a little longer. All right. All I can think is that I would be in serious trouble if I had to stop them getting to her and she was the main interest they were focused on. All right, now I need to find myself a lurcher. That looks likely. Let's irritate it. All right, now I've got to be careful and wait so I can use the thing. There we go. All right, I think I've got myself a tame lurcher, so let's head on over to the uh, ritual site. Normally that would worry me. Seeing it would worry me, but uh, it looks like we've got ourselves a friend. Uh, the ritual site is above. Uh, how do I get up there? Ooh, I'll have that. Alright, we're good. Let's go. Alright, so what I'm trying to work out is how to. Oh, okay, it looks like I found it. Is how to get up to the top here. So we're going to go up and we're going to go around. Uh, this way... Oh, wait, that's it there. By my blood, the corruption is washed away. Hmm. 
All right. The sacrifice has made this holy place pure again. We can begin the ritual whenever you are ready. That poor Spriggan spirit is finally free. It is a lurcher no more. Through its blood, we have cleansed this site. Everything is ready. And it's time to set the elemental guardians free. I agree. They've been imprisoned for much too long. Beldama, sisters, focus your power on the stranger. It's time to break Angov's hold on the guardians. Oh boy. Uh. At last, the chains of corruption fall away. We are free of Angoff's hold. Angoff will pay for this insult. Speak, champion of the guardians. We are in your... We are free. This is how it should be. You don't sound surprised. We are Earth's bones. We endure. We knew someone would come to set us free. We just didn't know when it would happen, or who it would be. It seems right that you were the one. You are mortal, but also not mortal. Oh dear. Angoff has much to fear from you. Oh. Angoff's evil flows deeper than the wellspring of this land. This must end quickly. How do we finish it? There is more work for you, champion. Go to the Weird Tree and find Weiris Gwen. We protected her from Angoff's slaves, but she cannot save the Weird Tree. That task belongs to another. Go and learn what must be done. All right, I'll go find Weiris Gwen. We might also, if we pass Chill House on the way, we might actually zip into there and discover it. Well, I'm liking that uh, that extra power that lets me right. So the workshop is down here. Yeah, look at that. So this is Death's Wind. I don't know what Death's Wind actually does. We could craft ourselves a set here uh, if we wanted to. If we had the traits too. You need to have the traits. Each thing you want to craft if you have a look. Like we can break that down. I probably won't actually. Let's just clear the selections. Um, so we need to know... Let's forget this. No set weapon types found. Okay, it requires two traits. It's in green and we have it. I wonder if we can make ourselves... So armor and health is what we get from this. Maybe not. I don't want to give up my magicka. But uh, if you need armor and health for your build, this is the place to come get it. Alrighty, that is one more thing marked off. Let's grab Legend of Chill House. Frigid air fills the darkness of Chill House as death's inevitable wind blows through the forlorn structure. Noises, familiar, yet their source indeterminate, seems to rise from beneath the earth, bedeviling the listener with memories of childhood stories. Groan of the goblin can and the imp with two hammers. I mustn't listen to the noises in Chill House. I mustn't. For if I listen too long and too closely, I might just go mad. Oh dear. Uh, hey Gerard, how you doing? I thought I was hidden here. Who are you hiding from? My Breton neighbours. Just because my father was a Reachman, they think I'm a cursed follower of Angoff. Angoff who? Angoff the Grave Singer. He's a Reach Mage, part of this damned Bloodthorn cult. You're not blind. You've seen <laughs> the vines, right? Yeah. How much do you? How do you know so much about Angoff? You don't trust me either. Look, oh, God. I'm loyal to the Covenant. My father came from the Reach thirty years ago with Durkarach's horde. <laughs> was wounded at Daggerfall and left behind, and my mother, well, she took him in. So your father told you about Angolf? I never met him, if that's what you're asking. My father told me tales of Angolf. He was a terror even back then. And now he's here in Glenumbra. Every Breton bully has joined his Bloodthorn cult. But I get the blame. What are you going to do? I was going to hide here until this blew over. But now Angoff's cultists have invaded the woods. 
If Angoff isn't killed or driven out, I've got no choice but to leave Glenumbra. Maybe a ship captain in Aldcroft will take me as far as Wayrest. Fine, you can run if you have to, but I'll try and help you with the driving out of the bad dude. We'll get there. The bad dude. The driving out of Angoff. We got it. Alrighty. Talk to Wiris Gwen. Oh dear. What? Who? Damn it all! The last person who snuck up on me got a sword in the gut for their trouble. Oh, I didn't mean to startle you. Wirisiliana sent me to help. Sorry. Old habit. Uh -huh. I was in the guard before joining the weird. Mm -hmm. Damned bloodthorns have taken our weird tree. I've never seen magic like this. I don't know what you can do, but if Elena sent you, Elena. your help is welcome. Okay. All right. Have a look around if you must, but we need to act soon. What can I do to help? The Bloodthorn cultists stole our portal stones. Mm -hmm. I swore off violence when I left the guard, but killing cultists might be the only way to recover the portal stones. I'll deal with the cultists for you. We need those stones to get into our enclave without being seen. Mm -hmm. Recover the stones and activate them inside the huts so my sisters can join you. All right. I still have my stone. Here, set it by the entrance to the weird tree and I'll step through to meet you. Okay, I'll take care of it. Okay, open the south, north, east and west portal. Start reclaiming the elements. Let's go. Let's go east first and then we'll work our way. We'll actually go counterclockwise. East and then probably north and then... Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, well at least that one didn't seem like it wanted to eat me. The wolves on the other hand. There's the hut. Let's see if we can get down to it. There we go. I know, I could jump off the cliff, but I, I I, am trying not to. Looks like those adventurers we saw running around before have already actually been here. There we go. Doorway. Alright. Uh, oh, there's a cooking fire. We need that. Uh -huh. Let me just zip this way. Grab that bookshelf deal with this haha <laughs> 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 didn't hurt <laughs> oh I'm sorry oh my gosh there's some lake bait if you're ever looking for lake bait you have to kill small creatures uh, in order to get their guts I know it's it's just logical but you know if you hadn't thought of it there you go Actually, which reminds me, I should be um, pulling the wings off insects because I'm short on lake bait. What am I doing? I am not seeing what I need. Oh, there we go. We have come to save the weird tree. Excellent. I'm glad to hear it. I'll just head on out and see if I can help you with the next one. I am going to have to deal with more monsters though because I took a bit of time and that means that means that the all the good work the other adventurers have done will be undone. I will help these guys. Not that they need my help but you know this will help them get the job done quicker. cooking fire so what we actually need is we need to make a fishy stick so let's do that and uh, I also need to make some Seralia wine I'm going to max that out so that I don't use up any extra spaces in my pack there we go um, I'll, I'll resist the urge to use that tea that mint alrighty what's next that's my north portal let's go I know I'm trying very hard not to be distracted by insect bits um, or bright shiny leaves on the surface. So we're just going to find the entrance to the hut. There we go. No, that's not it. It's a window, not a door. Since when did windows become regular entrances? Ah, uh, yeah. Oh no, is she okay? Oh, 
I hope she's fine. It looks like she's dead but not sleeping. That's a bit of a problem. Uh, nothing I really want in the crates today. We'll leave those for someone else to pick up. Backpack's already been ransacked. Do oh, My fellow adventurers have been here first. That's fine. There will be other times for treasure. I should actually be probably thanking them for... Oh, hi. Ow, do you... Oh, whoops. No, you don't mind because you're killing me. I'll just have a quick drink of that then. Oh man, I leveled. That's so cool. Um, we're, we're not quite halfway there yet, right? We'll claim those rewards once we get to a, a slightly safer point in the uh, in the dungeon. Let's open open this for our weird our weird sisters. Alrighty. The time Let's. has come to reclaim the weird tree. Claim our, it's also come to claim the time has now come to claim our level 20 rewards ooh covenant scout or mages guild why do I want those I know I want both of them but I will claim these ones covenant scout stuff all right crafting upgrade choice okay um Alright, I'm going to be fairly egalitarian this way. We're just going to bring our stamina up and I don't know if I need my health up. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay, E to commit my points. Alright, I said I needed some bow skills because I have a bow in my other weapons thing. So we'll, ouch, waste, I mean use two into that. We're going to grab a craft skill, because I should have actually used what, a craft skill before. Um, we're going to go for medium armor, which means I probably need my clothing. What does that give me? Proves the extracting of ingredients. Yep. Allows the use of jute and rawhide. Let's do that. Alright. Do you mind? Okay. I know, that, that costume is really throwing me out of the, the mood of... I've got a message. Oh, my costumes have been updated with the Covenant Scout collectible. Thank you, costumies. I know, I'm standing quietly in the corner and someone's bug zapping me. That's so rude. <laughs> I'm not that much of a menace. Alrighty. West Hut. Alright, then we've just got the south to go. I think we'll probably get this done before the end of the episode, maybe. Oh, let's bug some some bad dudes. Irritate them a little bit. Switch over to my bow. I've actually got... Oh no, I don't have a skill I can use in there. Radio. Oh, uh, uh, I forgot to rearrange it. Someone zapped me. Yeah, definitely been someone else has been here first. Alrighty. That doesn't matter. What does matter is we can rescue these nice ladies of the weird. Well they're probably nice unless you're unless you're poachers. Alright. While we're here and while I remember I think is it K K for skills. Yeah. Now we can get to work. Switch it to two. Now, I'm gonna just Alright, because I'm gonna get confused if I do this any other way. We're gonna go weapon. We're going to go bow. We're going to grab snipe. We're going to put it here. Uh, I'm going to put this here. What's that? I'm oh, it's consuming. Alright, hang on a minute. I need. I also need um, volley, I suppose we should use. I like impaling shards, though. Oh, wow. If I do that, I'm not going to have a lot of healing. Am I? Let's just grab volley. Um, we'll just use our our, um, our physical skills as our as our soul snatcher skills. Now I can. Hi, ladies. Rinky Tink. That's so cute. All right, Rinky Tink is doing the thing. 
Um, we've opened up that portal. I've just got one more to go. Hey, what's back here? Nothing much. Alrighty. So we need to open the south portal now. I saw it. Uh-oh. No, I didn't hear a bark, so that means the wolf isn't coming after me with extreme prejudice. South Hut portal, let's go. Alright, now we get to play with our new toys. We need to improve our bow skill. Oh, this is pretty heavy on our stamina. Yeah, move to flank. Ooh! <laughs> flip it through. Flip it. Flip it. Oh no, come on. Oh, I see. Yep. I know, I was hitting the wrong button. I was firing my bow instead of flipping my stuff around. So now we're trying to improve our bow skill as well as our um as well as our thing. And I, I this is a good way to just kind of get used to um It's in behind there. I know, it's so pretty. Does it have treasure? I don't know. Last portal. Let's go. Ooh. Backpack's already empty. What's in the background there? Excuse me for a minute while I just... Stand back. We shall begin the ritual. Wow. Oh, okay. Someone's been here before me, but that's, that's interesting to know. There you go. Alright, now I need to go where? Open a portal for Where is Gwen. Let's go help Where is Gwen now. Oh, okay, a letter to Weiris Gwyn. Things have gotten strange around the weird tree since you've been travelling. Remember those weird vines that began sprouting a few weeks ago? Well, they've grown huge and they seem evil somehow. I know it sounds crazy, but that's the only way I can describe it. Evil with a capital E. I noticed that the forest animals have become agitated and even aggressive when they get close to the strange vines. Moreover, as the vines grow stronger, the aggressive behaviour lasts longer. I'm beginning to fear that the creatures will attack soon. That's how much the presence of the vines has changed them. And now it's worse than I feared. Some of the vines have mutated, and now they spawn lurches from their corrupted thorns. I'm sorry, Weiress, but I can't stay here any longer. Bloodthorn cultists have attacked us and taken control of the portal's stone caves beneath our hearts. I can't prove it, but I'm certain these cultists are responsible for our recent troubles. I have failed you, but I hope you can forgive me. I know you won't listen, but I urge you to stay away from the weird tree until all this blows over. Whereas Dummy. Well, she's not dead, I guess. Alrighty, let us head to the weird tree. Maybe we can be of. Oh, that's not good. Did you do that? No, I don't think he did. Use the portal stone. Placed my stone well. I should be protected this close to the tree. What should I do next? We need to summon the guardians. With their power, we can cleanse this place of Angoff's foul influence. And how do I summon the guardians? Angoff's cursed vines prevent the guardians from getting anywhere near the weird tree. Find the vines that grow within the circles of weird blossoms and destroy them. That should allow the guardians to appear before you. All right, it shall be done. Okay, well, clear the corruption of earth, okay. Oh, okay. The earth weakens, Angoff's poison corrupts it. Together we will crush this vile manifestation. I'm ready. Good. I cannot harm this corruption of the earth, but I can protect you from its attacks. Listen to my warnings, and you will prevail. I don't know what you mean, but all right. 
I shall tell you when to return to my side. If you are close, I can shield These you from the spirit's attacks. Spirit casts a spell that shall shake the very ground beneath you. To my side, now! Come on back, guys. It is defeated. Do I need to? No, I don't need to do anything else there. Let's go. Clear the corruption of the air above. Oh, you mean above, above. I get you. Oh, there's the bark. Once you hear that bark, they're generally um, going to be facing a fight unless you outrun it. And, you know, avoid the XP you could be earning. Um, I've just got to find a way up and I've forgotten which direction. I think I should have probably run in the other direction to do this. going to need my stamina, so I suppose I should slow down a little bit. I definitely should have gone the other direction. Don't... I am not stopping to help him right now. Seriously. Seriously, the wrong direction. Ugh. Where am I? Yep, I see. Okay, well, alright. We'll run all the way back the other way. Because I'm seriously lost. <laughs> So if you look on the map, you've got like a, a dark ridge that shows you. Um, ooh, well, okay. I might be lost. So the other thing with this game is it's... You've got to be alert to opportunities to increase your skills whenever you have a chance. So that's my leisure domain, slowly increasing, but it only does that when I crouch down or hide to be able to unlock a chest. And um, I don't come across chests all that often. Alright. So we're going to madly run around the base of this thing. <laughs> try and find... Um, try and find this spirit of air. And I, Like I said, I think I went the wrong way. Oh, well, look at that. Hi. Retribution must be swift. Angoff will pay for his insolence. I'm here to help you. The weird tree must continue to reach for the sky. You must destroy the corruption of air. All right. Heed my warnings and you will survive the vile creature's onslaught. All right. When I call, come to me. My power shall protect you. Alrighty. Let us wander this way. So we've done earth, we've done air, we've done water. I wonder where we find fire. Ooh. Well, fire. Because in this camp, of course, is a mage's law book, which increases our mage guild standing, which we need. It's one of the reasons you um, visit the mage guild as early on as you can, because otherwise you're finding these books for nothing. There goes our uh, our erstwhile friends, having defeated the water spirit. This pollution is almost too much for me to bear. Help us restore balance to the weird tree. What should I do? Destroy the corrupting spirit, and then we can cleanse this place. Listen to my words. I shall offer what aid I can. All right. Stay close. 
and let my power flow over you. These stones belong to Angloss now. The tide of battle turns. To my side, now! Wow, he's got that, that ability to just drag you right out into the trouble, hasn't he? It is defeated. I can actually beat them on my own. It is nice when you get help, though. Uh, let us return to the weird tree, I think, to talk to Weiris Gwen. I suspect the other element is there. I'll just need to come around. A little bit more. Hey, how you doing? Where is Gwen? I can feel the oppressive weight of Angoff's corruption lifting. I sense the gratitude of the Guardians, but I also sense fear. Angoff's vermin are afraid. All of the spirits of corruption have been destroyed. You did well, and I'm happy to stand at your side. Now we finally have a chance against Angoff and putting an end to his unholy corruption. There's one more challenge we have to face, though. Oh, yes? Angoff's last wraith nests within the tree. Mm -hmm. It won't be banished very easily, but the Guardians promise to help you. When you're ready, enter the tree and expel the foul spirit. Right. I'll put an end to this right now. Although, for us, I'm afraid, that's going to be right now at the beginning of next episode. If you enjoyed this episode, please hit like. If you want to see more, please hit subscribe. I'll check you later. Take care out there.